guys, it's Robin, and I have an awesome Funko Pop haul today. Will you help me count them all? Count from Sesame Street. How awesome is that? I've got the count. I have this. Is she GameStop? GameStop Ray. Hot Topic exclusive Clark Ken. That's three pops. Wahaha. <laughs> Luke Skywalker from Endor. Four pops. Wahaha. Sorting Hack. Barnes and Noble exclusive Harry Potter. Five pops. Wahaha. And Veruca Salt from Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Six. Six Funko Pops. Good job, Count. <laughs> Let's get these guys out of their boxes and start with the Count. He is so cool. I love the Sesame Street line. These are just so awesome. Do I have them all now? I think I might still be missing Grover. I don't know. But I think I have almost all of them. They are so cool. Um, Count is actually pretty stinking epic. Check out the monocle, the hair. He's got his one. He's counting. I mean, so much detail. He has. A, he even has a little bow tie. That's so cool. Bow ties are cool. He's got this green cape on, and his little fangs. And you know, he is just so super cool. He's always one of my favorite Sesame Street characters, and that is just so awesome. Very excited to have him in my collection. Next we have Veruca Salt from Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, who is one of my favorite characters. She is like the worst brat ever. And she's like, I want to I wanna go and goose it lays eggs for Easter. Something like that, right? And there was actually a band called Veruca Salt after her. I thought it was pretty funny, like in the 90s. Um, but I absolutely love that she has this golden egg and that's the whole reason why I got her. Um, I did get the Violet who is the, the Comic Con exclusive one from Barnes & Noble and I'm probably not going to get any of the others. I do have an Opa Loompa and Willy somewhere. I haven't opened them up yet. I love her little red dress and her Mary Jeans. She's so cute. She just looks so ratty. But I love that dress. She almost looks like Annie with that red dress but the opposite of Annie. <laughs> She's just awesome. Oh, she has these freckles. I don't know if they're showing up or not, but they're really, really cute. Like on the bridge of her nose. I don't know why I'm talking like this. <laughs> that is so weird. It's so weird. Now, I was like, I didn't want to get another Ray because I have quite a few Rays already. But she just looks so sweet. This is Ray as we meet her on Jakku before. A lot of the action starts. She had gone back to her house and made herself some dinner. And um, so she's got, this is just so cool. She's got this helmet. It's a rebel helmet that she probably found. She scavenged. If you ever, if you want to um, know why there are rebel helmets and um, the, the walker on her planet, you should read the book Bloodlines. It tells you all about it. Um, and I think there's a video game too. So she's got this rebel helmet. And she also has a doll that pretty much looks like an X-Wing pilot. You, got, you can see her hair hanging out here. She's very bobble-headed. And like she's clutching this little doll. Which is like a little vulnerable. You know, she just looks like a little kid. And she looks kind of vulnerable. Which is really not, um, not very in character for Rey, I think. But I just think it's really sweet. It's a very sweet looking pop. And I really like that one. Um, yeah, I just had to have her. She's just, just really cute. Another one I wasn't going to get. But then I saw him and I just thought he was so cute. It is Harry Potter. And I have almost all of these from this wave. Except for the Dementor. Because it's just it's too creepy. It's just way too creepy. So here he is with his sorting hat. And he's sitting on a little stool. And his legs don't touch the floor because he's just a little guy. I think that is so cute. And um, can you see his scar? You can kind of see the scar a little bit on the forehead at the top. But I love, love, I just love the pose. He's like holding on to the seat because he's scared. And the hat, you can see the face on the hat here. So cool. 
and the hat is trying to decide which house to put him in because no, he wants to be in Slytherin or Gryffindor. And we all know it goes Gryffindor! So that is just so cool. He just looks so nervous. I, a really, really great design um, from Funko on him. And this one I saw recently at Hot Topic and I just thought it was so cool. I had to get it. Um, it's a Hot Topic exclusive Clark Kent pop. And it's just part of the DC superheroes line, not one from the movie or anything. And I just thought he's so cool because it's Clark Kent and he's tearing off the shirt. The tie is flying in action. He's got the suit, the hat, you know, he's Mr. Clark Kent reporter working for the Daily Planet and he's about to take off and go do some superheroing. I just thought that was so stinky cool. The hat is great, like the detail on the hat, like the, the dent and the bow, it's just really cool. And the tie. So cool. Awesome, awesome. I was trying to think of which superhero I have the most pops of in my collection. I don't know if it's Superman, Batman, or Spider-Man at this point. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to do an inventory. And this is another one. I'm, I've amassed quite a few Luke Skywalkers. But, I mean, it's Luke. How can I not collect Luke's? Um, he is part of the newest, one of the newer waves. There's a couple new waves, I think, of Star Wars characters. Um, he, it's not exclusive to anyone, but I think I got him at um, Think Geek, the Think Geek store. Luke heading off to Endor. And I really like this one because... It's a very cool. It has a lot of cool details. Like, he's got the gloved hand, his lightsaber. Um, there's a lot of, like, the camouflage look to the cape. He's got this helmet. It's just it's all very cool. I really like that. I mean, Luke, the character, like, most of the Luke pops look really generic. But this one, I think, looks a little more like him just because of the hand, I think. And the outfit is pretty recognizable. I don't know. I like it. Um... <laughs> I think I have maybe six or seven Lukes now. <laughs> There's just a lot of him. And I just got the one, the best spin Luke too. But I also like how his, his, um, his hand there is shiny. Oh, and look. <gasps> Whoa, Luke. And look, it's Luke and Ray. Oh, I can't wait to see these two together again. The next movie. Gotta wait till next year. No, 2018? 2017. I think 2017. <gasps> it's too long. So these pops are all so awesome. I have Endor Luke and this awesome Ray and Clark Kent and Harry Potter. I love that sorting hat. Everica Salt and the Count. Six pops all together. Very good job, Count. Which one of these guys is your favorite? Comment down below and let me know. I don't have one today. I absolutely don't. They're all so awesome and I love them. I mean, there are just so many cool things about all of them. Um, I hope that you will like this video and subscribe. And you can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Thanks so much for being awesome. May the force be with you. We'll see you again soon. Bye! Be sure to check out some of our other videos and hit that subscribe button.